This is Jay from Harvest Moon Homestead. That's one of the roosters. It's a beautiful day here in Indiana today. Kind of an early fall day today. Uh, cool temperatures, no humidity. It's uh, going to be a great day. Today's talk um, isn't really going to be that much about homesteading on this little talk. It's about something that's kind of important to me. In a few days coming up, as you can tell by the title uh, of today's video, it's the anniversary of 9-11. Um, and it's kind of a special day to me. should be a special day to everybody. Uh, as a lot of you know, I was a firefighter. Uh, I was in New York at Ground Zero after 9-11 happened. It's a day of a, a time period that I will never, ever forget. Uh, for many reasons. It, it was the worst of mankind, and part of it was the best of mankind. For whatever reason, humans have gotten so out of touch with life that they're willing to take thousands of lives. People just going to work, just doing their job trying to get by, uh, take those lives away in the name of either money or politics or religion, whatever the reason was. And depending on which theory you want to listen to, depending on who really did it, uh, whoever did it, it was, a, it was the worst of evil, the worst of mankind, uh, something you can never, ever forget, or uh, shouldn't forget. It was an attack on our freedoms, and that's a little bit on the home setting. It's about our freedoms, our freedoms to choose to live how we would like to live. So it, in a way, it was an attack on even homesteading, as remote as you want to look at it. Um, the tattoo on my thumbnail, if it did work, is a tattoo I got right after I got back from New York. Uh, I wanted to ensure every day I saw that, and it was always fresh in my mind. Not that it can go away. There were sites there that can't go away. Um, there were police, fire, and medical people that were on their way to help and were killed. Um, People want to put down all the uh, first responders anymore for whatever reason. Just Society has gotten out of touch with everything. I just want to make sure that everybody remembers what happened that day, one of the many different reasons why it happened that day, and, and try to help to where it doesn't happen. Um, like I said, it was the worst evil things that man could do. And I saw some of the best on our, on our way out there and on our way back. People knew we were firefighters. Um, they were appreciative of us. Uh, the people in New York, down in Manhattan, they, it was so nice, the different firehouses we had gone to, and even around where the pile was. All these p nice people were bringing out all these home-cooked meals to feed everybody. There were pallets and mountains of water and clothing. Restaurants would open up to let firefighters get a nap inside of them. It was just, it was the good giving side that you saw of New Yorkers. You always hear about the bad, but that was the good giving side of it. Uh, so there is good out there. That was probably one of the many reasons what got me into homesteading a bit was to get away from the craziness that's out there. And it seems like it's getting worse every year. The stuff you see on TV, which I don't even like watching anymore uh, on the news, it's just, People are losing touch with everything, and, and I don't see it getting better anytime soon, which is one reason why we're out here where we are, why we grow our own food, why we're trying to be self-sustaining. So I just want to remind everybody, don't forget what's coming up. Never forget what's coming up, and try to do what you can in your world to make sure stuff like that doesn't go on. So this is uh, Jay signing off for today, and never forget.